Hello. And today I want to talk about an introduction to the relationship evolution technique. The relationship evolution technique is for any two people who are in a relationship and want to improve that relationship. Its purpose is to improve your ability and your partner's ability to listen without judgment and to communicate with more honesty and authenticity. Uh, this technique, the relationship evolution technique, can be beneficial for any two people, whether they're partners or family members, like a husband and wife, a mother and daughter, a father and son. It can be used to improve the relationship in all social situations, such as by friends or lovers, neighbors or business associates, any two people. Well, one might ask, it's called relationship evolution. What evolves? Well, there's several important metaphysical principles that underlie the relationship evolution technique. The first one is that you, as an individual, are divine. You're a divine individual. You don't evolve. You're pure and perfect. There's nothing that can change or needs to change about who you really are. What does evolve and what changes is the second principle here, and that is nature evolves. The relationship evolves. Your consciousness of otherness evolves. The third uh, important thought and principle is that the purpose of life is to get closer to others. We use all sorts of methods and ways to get closer to others. And that brings us to the fourth point, that communication is the main way we get closer to others. And we use all sorts of various methods to communicate. We use words, gestures, feelings, emotions. We use the physical body to get closer to others, whether that is a pat on the back or a lover's embrace. So, if you want to get closer to others, develop your ability to communicate who and what you are and what it is that you're conscious of. Another very important point is communicate what it is that you want another to know without criticizing, blaming, abusing, making them wrong, or trying to change them. Chances are, if you do abuse and criticize and make others wrong, they will pull up their defensive net. They'll go into a ego a structure of resistance. So your best opportunity to get closer to others is to communicate without judging, without trying to change another, without criticizing or abusing or blaming them. So those are a few thoughts that I wanted to share with you around the relationship evolution dyad. Thank you for listening.